Even though a lot is still going on in the exhibition halls and naturally in the forums, the Intersolar Europe 2014 is gradually coming to an end. Time for us to review the last days. This year I have Jörg Meyer from the German Solar Industry Association with me. Hello. Mr. Meyer, the forecasts are rather modest, especially for the photovoltaics market in Europe. Nevertheless, the mood here was very good. Yes, the Intersolar has once again proven that it's the world's leading exhibition for solar energy. The companies are looking beyond Europe and are also doing business increasingly outside of Europe where the markets are growing. They're developing new business models. We have experienced all of this this year. And that's why there is this pioneering atmosphere. Let's discuss the technology for a moment. Which innovations, which ideas have we seen here? We have seen that solar energy, photovoltaics, is considering the system as a whole. It's becoming more intelligent, it makes energy management systems better, it's integrated into the networks, it's combined with battery storage. We have an entire hall for this. It sees itself as a type of power station just like other power stations. At the same time, we see the intelligent combination of solar thermal heating with other heating systems as well. This means our scope and level of integration are increasing. As I said, InterSolar Europe 2014 is almost over. What will we be talking about in a year? Which issues will we be talking about then? I think that next year will be all about smart topics. Smart everything, smart homes, smart mobility, smart metering. Everything will be more intelligent, more networked, and thus more customer friendly. This will make photovoltaics and also solar thermal heating even more attractive for customers. Wonderful. Mr. Meyer, I am looking forward to that. Thank you. Naturally, what InterSolar offers is also smart. As you know, there are exhibitions and conferences on four continents. As of last year, the portfolio has been expanded with a very regional component, namely a global conference program, the InterSolar Summits. At these summits, relatively small groups of roughly 200 to 300 participants from 10 to 15 commercial enterprises from the corresponding markets meet in order to access these new emerging markets. The new InterSolar Summit will take place in Chile, in Santiago de Chile. More information is available at intersolarglobal.com. That was all for the InterSolar Europe 2014. I'll leave you now with the most inspiring pictures from the week. Take care and see you again next time.